Hello everyone, good evening. Hope you all have been doing well. Um, in today's stream, we got a little bit of a, a surprise. It's nothing large, but I got a few. It's like, well, that's a good one to showcase. Uh, this one. Uh, Japanese kick it. Wait, what is that? There we go. Is that upside down? No, no, that's that's the right setup. Japanese Kit Kats for Christmas. Ten flavors to be exact. We got 20 total. Um, I gave 10 to Jeff and 10 are for me. And we're gonna be reviewing them on stream. I figured out what their names were through the help of uh, Google Translate and um, the internet. Otherwise, I would not know what this one is. Apparently, this one, fun fact, I think it's just dark chocolate. This took me like 10 minutes to figure out what it is, and I think it's literally just dark chocolate. But anyway, as I said, we got 10 Japanese Kit Kats. We're gonna be rating them with Jeff today. As you know, we do have a history on this channel that went back about, like, what, two years now? I think I had six followers when I found out about Japanese Kit Kats live on stream. What's another one here I could show off? Um, that, wait, this one... Oh, I don't even know how to pronounce this. Oh, right, okay, wait, yeah, yeah, yeah this one. This... Oh, I have missed the camera entirely. Um, it looks like a peanut butter and jelly. It's a Zuki sandwich flavored. That's, that's the name of it. Flavor is in the name as well. A Zuki sandwich flavor. That is the name of the Kit Kat. I don't actually know what a Zuki is. That's the one I did not look up. They're beans. Okay, so we got we got a, a bean flavored Kit Kat. That's what we're eating today. I'm getting less and less excited. <laughs> what do you mean, Jeff? Don't you like bean flavored sandwich Kit Kats? This is the tier list we have. Again, it's not much because there's only 10 flavors. I also have them all uh, right here. Let me showcase that. There we go. We got all the flavors right here. I'll be trying out. And Jeff with me, of course. But some of these are definitely a lot more normal than others. And there's nothing here that's extremely wacky. Okay, there's one here I legitimately don't know the flavor of. I used Google Translate. I looked at the ingredients. And the thing is, I thought I figured out what it was. But, <laughs> and then I went on to the next Kit Kat. And the next Kit Kat was the flavor I thought this one was. So I don't actually know what it is. Here, I'll just show. It's this one right here. I don't know what this is. It's just four cafe. The full thing is Kit Kat. For cafe. Oh wait, no. Tomorrow is another day. That that's that's what it says in Japanese. And the first ingredient in this is wheat. So, and you might be thinking, oh, it's the wheat Kit Kat. No, that's another one. I don't know, man. I was thrilled to learn all these. And also, this one right here, the sake flavor. Pretty excited for this one. It's the only one that comes with a warning. <laughs> um, yo, good evening, Jeff. Good evening. Yeah. You got your Kit Kats? Yeah, I'm not going to lie. I'm a little bit less excited for this <laughs> than I was earlier. Okay, let me tell you one that I think you will be excited about. Strawberry cheesecake. cheesecake. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I'm looking at that one right now. That yeah, one, I, I, I mean, if they were lying to me I in this picture, they'd have to be pretty... Ooh, they'd have to be really good at this. So this is the whole wheat biscuit flavor. I... Oh, it's a good crack. Oh, I haven't been showing this on stream at all. I, <laughs> I got a, I got a Kit Kat here. I don't know how to showcase this off. I really don't. Oh man, it's actually, wow, it that's tasty. Very much like wheat, but it's good. You know what's funny is that this kind of makes the Minecraft eating sound when you're chewing it up. It does. But you hear it. <laughs> but you hear it in your ears. <laughs> It's definitely very grainy. I guess that's the only way I can describe it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, but it's there's still that chocolate there. It's got quality. Mm -hmm. It is, it can, I do see the biscuitness. The biscuit attributes. It kind of reminds me of those little um, tea biscuits or something. Oh, yeah, yeah. And they don't the really taste about. like much of anything, but they're very vaguely sweet. Yeah, one second. Let me see if it I can. It kind of tastes like that, a little bit of icing. I think this is it. I think this is the container you're thinking of. Like this. Danish butter cookies? Yeah, Danish butter yeah. cookies. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. That. That is what this reminds there me of. There we go. Yeah, it. 
You know, I don't think I've Almost ever actually exactly. had these. There's always something else in them, but... <laughs> yeah, everybody mean. buys one ten of those and then uses it to package up everything else and never yeah. buys another ten. Honestly, I really liked this. This was good. I would eat this I would... in place of a regular chocolate Kit Kat. Like, hiking. Yeah, me too. Yeah, I would say... I, I you know what it. we should, should have on this here? Is what? it? Is a regular Kit Kat for comparison. A regular Kit Kat? Oh my gosh, how do I? Yeah. All right, give me a second here. Uh, we don't have a regular Kit Kat with us, but we both tried a regular Kit Kat before, right? Yes, we have in fact eaten a regular Kit Kat. Yeah. I'm not a huge Kit Kat person, but I will rate it a tier. Yeah. Well, so we gotta rate our wheat. Oh, bar. Right, we did have to. <laughs> we gotta wait our wheat bar, man. Come yeah. on. I like, you know, I like S because I think this is better than a regular I Kit Kat. Wheat a biscuit S tier. I agree with S tier. I would sooner eat this than a regular chocolate Kit Kat. I am gonna pick one that I was really interested in. The Shinshu. Wait. Oh, I'm butchering this. Apple. Shinshu apple. <laughs> those are yeah. those are apples. Apple. It's it's apple. There we go. Yeah. Basically, this just looks like a regular Kit Kat. Like you would have no idea. Yeah. Well, except that you could smell it from 20 feet away. No, that is true. All right. It does smell like a sour apple. All right. Oh, my word. word. Oh my gosh. My sweet lord in heaven. That's so much. Hmm. Oh, wait, the chocolate and apple do not complement each other well. I think I would sooner eat this than a regular Kit Kat, too, though. Really? <laughs> I actually love this. What? But, but, it's I so love much. apples. Okay, so it's like, take, um, so you, what you do is you, is you take chocolate and then a green apple. And then the Kool-Aid man busts through the wall and punches you in the face. That's what this is like. <laughs> personally, personally, I would put this at C tier. Uh, see, I would be comfortable actually, giving this a, a B tier. A B, okay. A, a B tier seems reasonable to me because I get how, while I love this, I can also see how most people would not. <laughs> yeah. Because it still tastes like apple in my mouth, and I've taken several sips of water. Man, you know, yeah, I can see if you really like apples. Like, I mean, like, apples aren't bad. I enjoy an apple. Man, who am I kidding? I've had an apple in here. You haven't had an apple in so long. <laughs> when was the last apple. time I've ever seen you eat an apple? That's Doctors true. should be at our house every day. Yeah, I don't think I've had fruit in years, so I need to... <laughs> anyway, we're not talking about my... pear the other day. I did have a pear the other day. Yeah, that's I'm, true. I'm disappointed there's not a pear flavor here. Angelina's not a fan of pears. And wash that out. You hearing this? <laughs> <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Police brutality in the chat? <laughs> uh, oh. Gosh, why are these tougher to open? Um, because you're bad at opening things. Why are we still here? Okay. Hurtful. <laughs> as I was going to say, the original name for this, uh, well, when I originally translated it, I thought it was like, what, white, adult white sweetness, but apparently it's sweetness for adults, so. <laughs> adult white sweetness? <laughs> Yeah. My expectations were higher. Mine weren't, and I'm still disappointed. Yeah. Mm, I'm getting any aftertaste. It definitely wants to be cookies and cream. Like, when it goes to bed at night, it dreams about being cookies and cream. Yeah. But I got bad news for it. Yeah. It's like, if you had to get a great value version, or if you ordered cookies and cream off of wish.com yep <laughs> i would say lower than the apple at For least sure. the apple was fun <laughs> yeah but this like, was just sad yeah i give this one a c c 
Just a weird name. Yeah, for the name too, Sweetness for Adults. Also an odd one. All right, we went very basic. I'm gonna go with, um, okay, a strawberry. That it was just now, really basic, so now we're gonna go and be really even more basic. basic. Okay, actually, the strawberry one is super good. I really dislike the cookie. If I could skin this and eat it, then I'd be happy. Yeah. I, but I the liked it. The aftertaste oh. to the cookie is a little. Mm, mm. It doesn't have. Oh, it's not the apple aftertaste, okay? If that's what you were looking for, you're not getting it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're right. I'm definitely not getting that. Yeah. Yeah, I thought it was fine. I thought it was B tier. I thought it was B tier too. Mm hmm. The bean one is next in the chart. Actually, it's your turn. It is my turn. So you know what? <clears throat> the bean one is next. Yo! It's bean chart. time. It is bean time. Bean. Well, let's go. It smells like chocolate. Ugh. Excuse me. That was <laughs> intense. I don't know if these are good for me. <laughs> <laughs> Had a little bit of bass to it. Snap, crackle, pop time. All right. Uh, I'm about to eat the larger half of a bean sandwich flavored Kit Kat. <laughs> it's never anything oh, that yeah. I thought I would do in my life. I mean, it just it, the fact that it just always looks like a regular Kit Kat is what scares me because I know this is not. I would love to repackage this into a regular Kit Kat wrapper. <laughs> That's mean. But maybe this All is right. just really good. All right. I go. will be shocked. Yeah. Cheers. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, wait. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> I don't want to finish it. I took one bite. I also took one bite, and I was going to say, I don't think I can finish this, and then I just couldn't manage to say even that. It has an aftertaste. Oh, man, that was so awful. awful. That was so terrible. <laughs> I'm trying to think about how to describe it. Didn't feel consistent. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I did not like that. I did not like that one bit. <laughs> That's why it was so hard to open. God did not want me to open that. <laughs> God was right. Yeah. <laughs> we should have listened to God. I would have rather tried to open the Ark of the Covenant. Than the yeah. Day, honestly, no. I, yeah. Eating that felt like the Raiders of the Lost Ark. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> we're the, yeah, we're the we got Nazis to play the Nazis. Nazis. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's what it felt like. <laughs> If you want to know Whoa. what it feels like to eat an Azuki sandwich flavored Kit Kat, just, just yeah. crawl in a microwave <laughs> for like eight minutes plus. Yeah, <laughs> that's it right there. You know, I think I would have rather had a baked bean flavored Kit Kat. I want to go for it something. It can only else. be up from here. Yeah. <laughs> I want to go with something I'm excited for. I'm going to go for the cheesecake. Now that is exciting. Yeah. That's really good. I does in fact smell like cheesecake. All right, cheers. That's really good. Yeah, I like that. I think I would put. This I like in this a one a lot. Yeah, at least yeah. Mm -hmm. I, I think definitely above a regular Kit Kat. All right, time for the other one that I'm scared of. Oh, what's that? The mystery one? The sake one. 
Oh. Mm. It smells like Play Doh. Play Doh? Oh, there we go. I think I got it open. <laughs> it smells like Silly Putty. No, it smells oh. like Fart Putty. That's what it is. <laughs> You know that's what it is. You know the little jar of fart putty. You just stick your fingers down in it. It, it does. Makes the one that makes that sounds. sound. But it does smell like those chemicals. I'm gonna get my break in. It probably it probably tastes like the fart putty smells. It it tastes exactly like the fart putty smells. And let me tell you, it doesn't really taste like sake. At least not the sake that I had. No, I don't imagine so. <laughs> I could handle this one more than more than the bean. Yeah, like if I was in a bunker and all I had was a gun and then a Zuki bean uh, Kit Kats, I would just shoot myself. <laughs> but, with, but with the sake ones, I might live. You might fight for survival. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. I might be like, you know what? This I can get cool. out of this. Yeah. <laughs> this is it forever. <laughs> I can find the wheat biscuit Kit Kats. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they are out there somewhere. Uh, that is a yeah, D. I would say D. I would definitely say above the bean. Y'all are dramatic. You have not had the sake Kit Kat. I do not want to hear it. You know what, I could just punch you in the face, and then we'll see who's dramatic. That's kind of what this felt like. <laughs> yeah. Only, yeah. instead of getting punched in the face by adult white sweetness, I got punched in the face by the flarp putty. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I got flarped, man. That's really just what happened. I didn't know that was a verb. Moment. And uh, I'm a little sad that it's become one. <laughs> I mean, I feel flarped after that. <laughs> I feel winded. I don't know what to. I don't know what to say. Like, so I'm less excited for this now that I smell it. Abby, where the, oh, I almost dropped the Kit Kat. <laughs> Cheers, Abby. All right. Cheers. Oh. Hmm. No. aware an expression of deep contemplation at this very moment as I try to determine if I hated that or, or loved if it, it wasn't so bad. Or yeah, not wasn't so bad. Definitely not loved it. Yeah, no, nobody loved that. Yeah. Except for it, the weird kid who really likes French candy. Yeah. It was like a roller coaster, but it mostly went down. I did not have a great time. It popped the whole thing in my mouth at oh. once. A brave soul. After the bean no, one, I figured it couldn't be any worse than beans. <laughs> <laughs> if anything's worse than the beans, it's mercury. It's just, it's a mercury yeah. Kit Kat. <laughs> You're showing up and I'm chewing on a chunk of uranium coated with charcoal. <laughs> yeah. Mm, yummy. It's got to be like so many calories right there. Yeah. <laughs> Better believe it. I need them. <laughs> bulking up days. real quick see see yeah just see yep <laughs> see <laughs> like I would eat one of these before the sake yeah compared to the sake this had ups the sake did not the sake was just down the, yeah the sake was down it wasn't a this... nose dive crash down but it was down yeah mm -hmm. you know I'm just impressed with how flavorful they've been, you know, yeah. like a lot of American flavored stuff. You just get hints there, of yeah, whatever flavor a, it's supposed to be. A blueberry muffin Kit Kat I had not too long ago. What? Yeah. Found it in a CVS. <laughs> and you didn't buy me one? Nope. I bought it for me. 
I didn't know I didn't know how much you like Kit Kats. I didn't know you were like me. But I love blueberry muffins. That's fair. And I gotta say, it did kind of taste like a blueberry muffin. I think it could have passed for a Japanese Kit Kat. You want to try the um, the dark chocolate cocoa? Yeah, the dark chocolate. Hmm. Hey Jeff, can I be honest with you? You don't like dark chocolate, do you? I don't like dark chocolate at all. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! It's just like eating a spoonful of cocoa powder. I love dark chocolate. Hmm. I'm all about some adult black sweetness. This tastes just like the time like a couple years ago i suddenly had the dream to become a baker and i made chocolate in like an ice cube tray and it tastes just like that huh spoiler alert interesting i'm not a pro baker and you do have to like dark chocolate yeah like why why do you guys like dark chocolate give me some give me some essays in the chat here yeah like well i, just... I mean i like bitterness it's very relatable on an emotional level. Well, unlike you, not all of us are depressed. Yeah. The floor cafe, it's the only one we have that's vertical. There are vertical ones, this is not the only one. Gosh, the vertical wrapper is in the office. Wait, this is just a regular wrapper. Yes, it is. It's just printed differently. It's just no it's, change. It's just printed, yeah. Cheers. Wait, this is just a Kit Kat. But yeah, I think this is literally just like a Kit Kat that's made in Japan. That's just a Kit Kat. The Kit Kat that just used better chocolate, better weight healthy, maybe. and went to the gym and you know read an hour a day. Yeah, you got eight hours of sleep. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> have maybe that's a little much. Above <laughs> us. <laughs> Don't ever buy the wasabi Kit Kats. Well, you you under, you see, I'm a coward. Like I'm not too much of a coward to try the bean flavored Kit Kat. But the wasabi flavored Kit Kat, like I didn't know what the bean flavored Kit Kat would be like. I know what the wasabi. He's not Kit into Kat's pain. Really like yeah, it's, <laughs> it's just not into raw pain. Nope. He's a chicken chat. Hey, I tried the bean flavored Kit Kat. Bean flavored Kit Kat. All right. If he were a chicken, oh, he on, would man. be fried. And then he would look very different in that chair. <laughs> it would be a bucket instead. It would be a bucket. And it would be a constant KFC advertisement. What? Come on, guys. What is this? What is, what is this aggressiveness? Thank you, Lamb. Happy as a drumstick? Um, <laughs> yeah. I would say, like, I would say my legs are like drumsticks, but I gotta say, they're bigger than that. Yeah, you played the Colonel Sanders dating it's game constant. on stream, didn't you? No. And, and you haven't done a Colonel Sanders cosplay? <laughs> no, don't give them ideas. <laughs> hey, we hit a thousand followers. I'll do a Colonel Sanders cosplay. Full send. I'll dye my hair white. Made dress. Yeah. <laughs> no, 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 no. That's what I do for 750 followers. Jeff cosplay, I would have to get a lot hairier for that to happen. <laughs> Colonel Sanders in a maid dress. Colonel Sanders already has the best outfit known to man. This is always the image I pull up whenever I want to show Colonel Sanders on stream. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Tabby Giant coming at you pre-recorded. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video. It's not my best work. I spent a long time editing it, and so a lot of things are just a little inconsistent. And I wouldn't say it's probably the best video I have edited, which isn't many. Um, but I hope you enjoyed it either way. I'll be trying to get some more videos up soon. And yeah, I meant to get this up a lot sooner, but well, many things. I'm not. I've got. I've got. A, I've got a list of excuses if you'd like them. They're not good, but they're there. 
The number one is I'm lazy. Does that count? Anyway, I uh, hope you enjoyed the video and also make sure to subscribe if you are new here because apparently only 0.2% of you are subscribed. I don't know how that works. I've only got like, I, I don't know how many views I've gotten in the last 30 days, but it's not a lot. So uh, yeah, you 98.8%, 99.8%, make sure to hit the subscribe button. I appreciate it a lot. <laughs> but yeah, thank you for stopping by. Hope you, uh, hope you enjoyed the video and yeah, I'll be seeing you next time. All right, good night, God bless you all. Peace and God bless.